Hey guys, Peter here with Forte Trader, and as you see on that screen, slow and steady wins the race. And what does that mean? That means exactly what it says right there. When it comes to trading, slow and steady wins the race. I used to hear that all the time. I've been a trader for years. In fact, when I used to hear that, I'd get so upset because I always had small accounts, and I wanted those accounts to explode real quick off all the thousands of dollars I had spent on all the schools on the internet painting dreams to me that I was going to make big home runs almost all the time if I just followed rules. Guess what? It never worked out that way. It just never did. I blew out two accounts. Two accounts. Okay? I went started from penny stocks to forex and this and that. All this stuff. I did everything from technical and learning fundamental and how to read this report and that report and this report. And somehow every time I tried to learn something too well, it just didn't work. People said keep things simple. When I try to keep things super simple, it didn't work. What works for me? Really simple now. Slow and steadily. Calendar spreads. I always admired futures trading. I love the commodities exchanges because they're regulation. They're not like Forex. I like Forex for price action. Don't get me wrong. However, I love futures markets because they don't have a lot of the corrupt stuff I believe equity markets have. And they don't follow headlines too heavily per day. So you don't have a lot of this volatility. You do have volatility in futures, but we control that. How do we control that? Calendar spreads. And I want to talk about that today and how why slow and steady wins the race on steroids. Now, the main focus of this video is span margin. There's a reason to this. A lot of people out there on the internet, especially probably watching this video, all try to master futures trading, outright trading. What is that? A single purchase contract or selling of a futures contract at a later for a future date? Doesn't matter. One contract, buy and sell. Let's keep this real simple, okay? Super leveraged. You're talking. You're you're, you're talking an account that is a uh, uh, has a very high notional value, just in it of of itself, okay? How do we control that? How do we mitigate that risk? How do we define and lower down the volatility? We like volatility when it's on our side. But the market doesn't always work that way. It's not written for you. It's not written for me. And so how do we mitigate that? And how do we also define the, the currency risk and hedge out of that? Calendar futures spreads. Span margin is what I want to talk about. There's affordability in trading futures calendar spreads. It allows us to all be involved in the commodity or future that we're trying to be engaged in and still make money and still sleep at night and be in the market overnight, over headlines, over news, over reports, and not give a crap about any of that stuff. Let's check this out and why I talk about that, okay? Um, let's see. We've talked about crude oil calendar spreads. In fact, if you haven't watched the video, watch the prior video on YouTube. Every month, I'm gonna give a free calendar video, a free opportunity to make money on your own, I don't want anything from you. You can take it. You don't have to take it. I don't really care. I'm going to take it. I trade my own money with it. And it's an idea I share to build rapport with the trading community. I do have a boot camp coming out soon. And I expect people to sign up for it. If you want help, you go to ForteTrader.com. Do not sign up for the boot camp yet. Just sign up on the mailer. Go to the homepage here, guys. It's a short boot camp. I'll be in there with you. 10 videos and one month free on a Facebook private group. I promise I will guide you through this and you will, you should make your money back on this. I cannot legally tell you that. Just sign up below here to receive it. I'm not trying to sell you anything. Just get on there. We do not spam anybody. I'll keep in touch with you when the boot camp is ready. The point of that is this. We've talked about in the prior video, crude oil calendar spreads. Price action trading in a direction, but you cannot get into an overnight long-term uh, position on the calendar, uh, I'm sorry, on the outright because of money, lack of capital. Plus, these are big high emotional accounts. Big boy, big girls playing these things. And a lot of us small-time guys and gals, we want to make money on these. We have a good sense of them. We've studied enough with them. But how do we get engaged? Calendar spreads, calendar spreads, calendar spreads. So you have a directional pick on crude oil, you want it to go in a certain direction, you place a calendar spread. How and why is not the point of this video, it's just to make for 
Some of you that have been engaged in margin in, in futures trading that under that know that it takes, uh, you know, there's very cheap day margins offered by brokers out there, but it takes a lot of money to be in overnight. There's it's frustrating, isn't it? Well, let me show you an example here of the cost of overnight crude oil. If you follow my arrow here, maintenance margin overnight, initial margin thirty four ten to thirty one hundred dollars. It costs to carry one contract of crude oil overnight day in day out one contract in whatever crude oil does it's going to whip you around ten dollars per tick today is october 10th 2018 as of this video crude oil had made a dollar and almost two dollar move during the day don't look at this over here please ignore this this is an overnight trading session where we're back up 32 cents but we made a dollar almost a two dollar move so that could have cost you almost two thousand dollars on an outright how do we decrease that with well, a calendar spread? But how do we also increase our chances to profit on these directional moves when we have a directional bias with the calendar spread? Span margin again is the bias of this video, and so I'm going to keep it real quick and simple. First of all, guys, real quick here, um, disclosure statement. I got to by law put these in here. Please read it. Understand that you've probably read it a zillion times. Of course, boring. Yada yada yada. Okay. Anything I show you guys, I'm not guaranteeing it, okay? Past performance, not indicative of future results. Be careful of trading, you know, risk capital, all this stuff, mumbo jumbo. Take the time and read it. As long as I put it up here, I'm not going to sit here and be pretty and read it. Done. That's done. Now we're in the clear. Let's go ahead and talk about this uh, mar the span margin we're talking about. Initial margin to run one crude oil. Uh, contract costs that much overnight and overnight while you're sleeping anything can happen OPEC the cartels of oil Saudi Arabia somebody Donald Trump tweet something you're you're losing big-time money you want to trade Hey, look this is last year guys on every calendar spread I've been up over 100% on 75% of the trades limited to 25% of them cut the cut cut the losses moved on took two big losers I've learned from that I'm not doing that ever again and let's just talk about how we get in affordably on these here's a margin calculator with a firm I call DT Pro I really like these guys I use them for I use uh, TD Ameritrade as well but I really really use for my spreads DT Pro okay I have a broker I work with there directly I have negotiated commissions and for all the clients that I refer we have really really discounted commissions there if you go there without me, you may be subject to really luxury commissions. But let me go ahead and I'm going to just make an example here of a crude oil spread. And I'm going to just pick December, okay? And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to add another contract. And it'll be, um, let's say, I don't know, this is January or whatever, F9, okay? We're going to, let's just say for the purpose of this example, go short January and long December. It doesn't matter. You can do whatever you want here. I'm going to check these boxes. This is the margin calculator tool. And guess what? I'm now reduced down to 506 holding for this calendar spread. If I have a directional bias or basically a seasonal bias like I do over here on this seasonal bias that I'm holding here right now, this idea is going on right now in October 2018. If you, you know, Short January and long March or do whatever you want front and back month. We are on a whole, the historical seasonal opportunity We have bias in a certain direction. Okay, so it's up to you But the point is five hundred and six dollars to hold these contract hold this position in a big boy big girl world. Okay Potential to make way more than that if this stock moves. I'm sorry stock if this commodity moves and is likely up to move to $80, it's a $5 move. That's 5,000 ticks. It's a $5,000 move on the outright. On the other hand, if it breaks down under this uh, prior uh, resistance, which became support just a couple of days ago, okay, and it moves down another $3, 3,000 ticks. Now, on the spread, it might not be as much, but it's a whole lot of damn money for a $500 investment. That's how we make money in a smart way with leverage. Okay, then keep this video short, but I want you to understand what span margin is in this video. Span margin by taking a front month and a back month calendar spread depends on how far out we go. Your, your cost basis on your span margin can get wider, but if you come in real tight, front month, back month, like let's say January, February in this example, it can get as low as $300 per contract. 
Now, I want to talk about the people that are making home runs, making home runs out there and promising you, boom, $10,000 home runs on $200 option stock trades. Look, guys, I've been around the block a long time, long enough to tell you this. They're out there. They're outliers, okay? This is the greatest opportunity to make money steadily where the pros are, where the institutes are, where all the professional guys are hedging their money. In fact, all the big um, just the, the manufacturers and stuff are here in this, in this world of futures and commodities making, uh, hold on one second here, guys. <laughs> this is the word place where you want to be. Let me take this trade here, for example. This was a wheat trade we were in. We entered this trade on September 8th. Okay, it's a short buy trade with the potential to come back up. We got in this trade for three business days, September 8th. We shorted uh, wheat from March and we went long on May. On a longer scale level, it's kind of stagnantly going low, but it's very visible, guys. Visually on an 80% statistical chance, this stock, this commodity is going lower. To, in order to avoid the pullback and give it a little test run, we caught, got in this trade with a $253 Span margin. Overnight, slept, ate, everything. Went over the weekend and, and worked other things and hung out with the family. Had a barbecue and had some beers. And then we were up two. We were up 100% on Tuesday. Close this trade out. Okay. I'm very simple. I try to take profits off real quick. If I have multi contracts, I'll let one run. But if one contract, I'm gonna take it off at 100%. That's my rule, and that's how I do it. That's real money, real trading. Now, here's my other point. It's 12 minutes. I got to cut it short soon. Well, you want to hit a home run? Once you get this down, why don't you do 10 contracts? In three days, you turn it $253 times 10, $2,500 plus dollars into $2,500. You just hit a home run. But because I keep things simple and I show you how to make $250 out of $250, don't get misled that there's not a big world out here, ladies and gentlemen. This is the place to make big money. This is the place to make home runs. But you start with base hits. Okay? Like I said before, slow and steady wins the race. Slow and steady wins the race. I've been doing this for years, folks. I survived this long because slow and steady wins the race. And I've taken a lot of hits. A lot of hits. I'm not rich. I'm not a millionaire. I'm rich in my mentality. I know I'm going to get there. But it goes with commitment. And it goes with finding something that works that's real, that has structure, that has statistical edge. Using span margin in futures calendar spreads works. I have a boot camp coming up soon. I would recommend you sign up. Go to fortitrader.com. Do not sign up in the order page. You can read about the boot camp. I don't care. Send me a message, okay? This used to be a prior school I had with some partners. I'm gonna continue this. I'm gonna teach you guys how to do this, okay? So just go to the homepage. Just sign up just for to be on the waiting list on a mailing list. I will be in touch with you guys soon. I'll let you know how the profit progress is in the boot camp. I will personally give you 30 days in a private Facebook group. We'll coach you. One trade can pay off this boot camp. Okay? It's not really a sales pitch. That's not my point in this video. The point of this video is understanding span margin in futures and commodities world, how to take advantage of it and make big profits, little base hits, and big home runs when you're ready to throw a big 10 lot or a big 20 lot contract out there. Okay? Anyways, thank you folks, and I'll talk to you later.